गुड इवनिंग फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो विल डिस्कस अबाउट एक्सटर्नल स्टोरेज क्लास फीचर्स ऑफ ए वेरिएबल डिफाइंड टू हैव एन एक्सटर्नल स्टोरेज क्लास आर एज फॉलोस स्टोरेज विल बी इन मेन मेमोरी then default initial value is zero then scope is global that means this external storage class variable can be accessed in all the functions that is called global scope global scope scope means we can access in any function then lifetime is till the program terminates till the end of the program the variable is available in memory and the keyword used is extern in lower case we write extern e x t e r n these are the properties of uh, external storage class variable storage will be in main memory and default initial value is zero and more importantly its scope is global and a lifetime is till the end of the program so let us demonstrate these properties with the help of a program how external storage class variable is declared inside a c program i have written a simple c program containing two variables just see here so this is my main function and before main i have declared one variable x with the initial value 21 if a variable is declared outside of the main then that is global variable that means its scope its scope is global that means without uh, redeclaring it we can use in any function that is called global scope or you can call it as global variable now i have one more uh, variable here after the main function i declared defined one more variable say int y is equals to 31 now both are defined outside the main you can say this is main from here to here this is main okay so both are defined outside the main but one is defined uh, before the main and uh, the other one is defined after the main both having the global scope now you can ask me a question where is the external keyword used so if a variable is defined before the main function when your program starts execution what happens first this statement it's this okay so that means the definition of the variable is known to the compiler okay so then it enters the main function and when it prints uh, this x value x value will be printed as 21 because this is called usage of the variable okay so variable usage has been done after defining the variable that means definition is seen first by the compiler then the variable is used here okay so in such case compiler doesn't give any error but when it comes to y here just see here so first uh, you are printing the y value that means y used first then after then the definition is seen here okay that means without uh, defining the variable you are using that variable which is not allowed in a c so that's why the compiler gives error in this case that means why without a definition you are using it that is what the compiler understands by the time it comes here there is no information about why to the compiler here just see here so into main enters the main then print up suddenly you are saying uh, x comma y x is already known to the compiler because before main it has seen this x value 
okay but suddenly you are asking the compiler to print y value but there is no information about a y after completing this main function then you are giving information okay so that means by the time it reaches to this statement there is no information about a, the variable y so that's why the compiler gives error so to overcome this to inform the compiler that y is declared externally we must inform the compiler that y is declared externally somewhere else not inside the main okay so that can be done by using external keyword that is called external variable to overcome this now we can use external keyword in this form just see here external variables are declared outside all functions yet are available to all functions that intend to use them so here x and y both are external variables okay but x definition is seen first that's why it doesn't give any error here but y definition is not known and you are trying to use that variable that's why in case of y it gives error okay so to overcome this what we need to do is we must inform the compiler that y is an external variable declared externally okay so that this int y is equal to 31 is called definition okay so now you have to declare it to the main function okay so this is how you can declare a y as external variable so here we can use this keyword extern here extern int y please remember this is only a declaration that means declaring to the compiler no memory is allocated memory is allocated in this statement in the definition okay so this statement is only declaration to the compiler you are telling that y is an integer variable which is declared externally that means somewhere else its definition is available compiler please go and look into that that is what uh, the message is conveyed to the compile okay so when you write like this then first it looks into this statement extern int y then compiler understands that y is an external variable okay so before printing this y it gets the y value okay then when this print of statement is executed it goes to that uh, y location and uh, prints the y value here this is how the extern keyword can be used in a program clear so let us see the execution of uh, this and what type of error will be displayed if we don't use extern uh, keyword here okay another use of extern is in multiple files if you have data or variable in one file and you want to access in another file in such case we can use this uh, extern keyword so that will be demonstrated when we discuss about a uh, files concept so first let us see the execution of this uh, extern keyword yeah it is giving warning here not included in the dev version
but still between 60 and 5 and it's 21 and 21 just see here so if i ignore this then it to one let us see whether it runs or not now you can see error here now see why undeclared first use in this function okay so this definition is outside you are using inside the main so usage is seen first after the definition that's why you are getting this uh, error message here in red color you can see the error why undeclared let's see here okay so that's why you must uh, declare it to the compiler as external variable okay so in this case we won't give any error clear thank you please subscribe to my channel if you like this video and click on like button